On the fifth anniversary of the Brexit referendum, British Prime Minister Boris Johnson praised leaving the EU as a driver for jobs and renewal. He said, this government has done the Brexit and we have already recaptured our money, our laws, borders and waters, said Johnson in a statement. And if we recover now from this pandemic, we will use the true potential of our regained sovereignty to unite and raise our entire United Kingdom to a higher level. Yeah. I don't know how many people still fall for this, but I bet it's a lot, unfortunately. On June 23rd, 2016, people in Great Britain voted with a narrow majority to leave the EU. The move took place after long negotiations at the end of January 2020. And since January 1st, 2021, the UK has also ceased to be a member, or in this case, the Great Britain has also ceased to be a member of the EU Customs Union and the internal market. This has had serious consequences, for example, for trade, but also for people who want to live and work in Great Britain. Johnson was one of the driving forces behind the Leave campaign to leave the EU. Critics, on the other hand, point out that Brexit has hit the British economy hard and the country is also facing an acid test. The Scottish government is striving for independence and a return to the EU. The majority of Scots voted to remain in the community in 2016. However, the British Minister of State Michael Gove made it clear in the newspaper Telegraph that a new vote on separation from the United Kingdom was hardly conceivable before the next general election, which is planned for 2024. The situation in Northern Ireland is also complicated. The British province is de facto still part of the EU Customs Union due to the Brexit withdrawal agreement, but this has created a customs border for goods with the rest of the UK. Many observers see the peace process in the former civil war region at risk. Former Deputy Prime Minister uh, Michael Heseltine criticized that Brexit was by no means over. It's only just started and the prospect is dire, said Heseltine, who is a member of Johnson's Conservative Party. Brexit threatens the peace in Northern Ireland, deceives the fishing industry and undermines the competitiveness of British farmers. In addition, the important financial industry is shifting its activities more and more to the EU because otherwise it would not have access to this important market. And I'll see you in my next video. Auf Wiedersehen.